we go. Alright, what is up y'all? Welcome back to another video. Today we are back down on we are back out on the river, but I'm with my brother as you can see behind me right there. And we're gonna be seeing if we can't get him his first fish on the fly rod. He's never really fly fished much. He's done like some pond bluegill stuff. So this will be his first time properly fly fishing. And we're gonna see if we can't get him on a gar. So anyways, take you along with us and let's do it. All right, here's my setup. Got my nine foot eight weight lamps and liquid. And just running this small little, small little gar fly right there. And my brother is running something very similar um, except on a five weight, nine foot five weight. So anyways, let's get down the river, see if we can't pull out a few fish. Oh, pulled it out of his mouth. Okay, Nat, there we go. Here, toss it to me. Or get him. Okay, bring him to you. Okay, right here. Okay, here we go. Go for the head. Head, 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 head. There we go. Fly just popped out. Solid. There we go, there's the first fish of the day. We were worried because the water's cooled down a lot, but we've seen some bigger ones. This is a small one we've seen, but he ate it. So here we go. Here he goes. We get my brother to get one now. After giving my brother a quick lesson on casting, he was ready to go and try to catch his first car on the fly. And it didn't take long before I spotted one for him to cast at. It's right there. Still coming down. Right there. Where my rod tip is. Oh, oh, yep, he's on it. Cast right back at him. Strip that in, across his face. Fast, 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 fast. Yep. Nice. Nice, bro. Nice. Got him. He's not gonna like this net. Oh. That was awesome. You got him hooked pretty good. Woo! Nice job, Landon. There we go. There we go. My brother's first gar right there. It's fun. There's the fly in his mouth right there. Let's see if we can pop it out of here. Oh, you got him on the, not the treble. That's surprising. Yeah. Oh, dang. Got that fly out. There's that fish. Here he goes. This fish, bro. Thank you. Well, that fish destroyed that fly. He ripped the treble hook right off the back of it. So that's the last small gar fly I have. So we'll size up there and hopefully pick off a few more. He went up against the bank. Oh, I got snagged on a rock. Oh, did he eat it? Yeah, he's on it. Oh, no way, he snapped me off. Oh, you tied the knot on this one, that's okay. <laughs> Dang. That's tough. Well, I didn't have any more gar flies with me in my box, so just tied on a little purple woolly bugger. We're gonna see if we can't catch either gar or maybe some other different types of species on this. All right, well, I'll see if I can, before you hop up on that log, I'm gonna toss my little fly. Bass will eat it, so I'm gonna toss it up against this log to see if there's any fish. You should have a lot of room to work. Let's see a little 
us. Here we go. It's a little bass. Sight fished him. Let's see what he is. A little largey. Beat up largey. Well, there we go. We walked upstream and I just spotted this little bass. And since I don't have a garfly, toss a little woolly bugger in and a little largey. Gotta love him. He's beat up. Got some nasty growths, but it's fun fish. Back in the water. Sweet. Some crawdads down here, too. Thanks, too. All right, we stopped at this little spot. We haven't seen many gar. I've seen one, but uh, I don't know. We caught the little bass, seen a few sunfish. We're just going to kind of take a minute and enjoy the little, this little creek spot. Maybe pick up a few more fish if we can. I have a fish on. Uh -oh. oh, he popped off. I set my rod down. It was a bass. It was a decent bass too. No way. That was awesome. A lot nicer of a bass than the last one I caught. Dang, I hope the uh, GoPro and drone picked that thing up. There's a little bass. I don't even know if he's dead. He's just sitting on the bottom. Oh my, I just got snagged. Oh, there we go. Hey, a little largey. That was awesome. He was just chilling there. Let's get him unpinned and back in. Awesome. All right, so unfortunately that wraps up fishing for today. Only fished for about two hours, didn't have too long. Um, but you know, gotta get back, gotta get things done. The sun's starting to set. Well, it's just getting past the tree line, which makes sight fishing extremely hard. And anyways, yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed today's video. Hopefully you can learn something from the setup and paddleboard portion of the video. And if you did, please go back and watch my other videos um, if you liked this video, because we are so close to hitting the monetization requirements for YouTube. We just need a few more hours of watch time. So um, thank you all for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.